And now we have a very special guest, two guests on the on the uh, songwriter circle show here. I have standing right over there, eleven year old Angela Muck. Say it into that microphone. Oh, you know what? Brent's got to turn that microphone on. See this on button? There. Try that again. Makahi. Makahi. Eight, uh, 11 year old. You're 11. Um, how long have you been singing? Well, my entire life. Yeah? So how old are you? I'm 11. So you started singing when you were born? No, but no. I just, I never really started. I just. Yeah. you just always. Yeah. You're just always singing. And where are you taking your lessons right now? Natural, natural growth. Natural growth. So story, because I yeah. put I put a call out and uh, story answered and said, I know a girl who'd like to sing a Brent and Woofy song with you on the radio, and that's you. <laughs> All right. So are you ready to go? You're not nervous or anything, are you? I am. Poor girl, shaking like a leaf. So I guess maybe we should just get into <laughs> this, and um, we'll just go right ahead. This is, song is called Chost. Chost, and it is off the Brent and Woofy Shine 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 CD, which was recorded. Years before this girl was born, it was recorded in 1995. What year were you born in, Angela? 2007. Yeah, so this song is like twice as old as you are. So we're just going to get right into it, and um, it's called Chost. Cheese and Toast makes Chost, and here goes Angela. One, two, three, four. Chost, Chost, beautiful Chost. I like it a lot, and I eat it the most. Chost, Chost. Beautiful toast, cheese and toast makes toast. Cheese and toast makes toast. Wait for it, wait for it. To make some toast is what you'll need. A slice of bread and some wonderful cheese. A little bit of pepper, some orange salt and 350 degrees. And you can make toast, toast. Beautiful toast, I like it a lot, and I eat it the most. Toast, toast, beautiful toast. Cheese and toast makes toast. Cheese and toast makes toast. Ask, ask your mom, dad, ask your mom or dad to slice the cheese. Turn on the oven, don't forget to say please. Add your salt and pepper, some TLC. It's as easy as one, two, three. And you can make toast, toast, beautiful toast. I like it a lot, and I eat it the most. Toast, toast, beautiful toast. Cheese and toast makes toast. Cheese and toast makes toast. You know what, kid? I think I missed a verse in my own song, didn't I? There's another verse, isn't there? Yeah. That's my bad. That's not you, Angela. Angela, Angela, that's my bad. So what's the next verse? Um, ask, no, no, place it in the oven for 10 or 15. Can you believe that? I messed up my whole song, my own song. So we'll try to get, or take it right from, uh, place it in the oven. Now place it. Go. Now place it in the oven for 10 or 15 minutes until the cheese is melted. I think it's ready. Can I have some, please? Let's have some toast and cheese. And you can, can make, make toast, 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 beautiful toast. I like it a lot, and I eat it the most. Toast, toast, beautiful toast. Cheese and toast make toast. Cheese and toast make toast. Cheese and I like toast. Yeah. Very good. Go ahead and clap for her. Yes. Very good. My apologies. I ruined the song for you. But you did good. You did flying colors. Thank so you. where's your next stop? You're going to Carnegie Hall. What's next for you? I know. <laughs> Thanks very much, Angela. That was Angela Mulcahy. Did I say it right? It's Sing close enough. Close enough. All right. Thanks a lot, kiddo. Really appreciate that. All right. Okay, that was Angela. She's 11. She was singing Toast. And now we have six-year-old Myra. Eight. Eight-year-old. How old are you? Let's. Can you can you pull that microphone down for her? 
so she can talk into it now yeah yeah you want to get your teacher oh she's got to get her piece of paper okay you go get your piece of paper and your teacher and we'll just wait for her big big moment thanks a lot guys here comes Myra and here comes Marion Smith of the Nanaimo Youth Choir. And I should tell you folks about Marion that um, I got a hold of Marion back in 1994 or 95. And she provided a whole bunch of singers for a bunch of my CDs way back in the day. So I asked her if she would know of somebody who would like to sing on the radio. And she's come up with Myra Northrup. Mara. Oh, somebody did correct me. I got that wrong, too. Mara, speak right into that microphone and say hello. Hello. How are you? Do you know how you yeah. are? How are you? What Good. do you got on your shirt? What's on your shirt? Ladybug. Ladybug. Speak right into that mic, sweetheart, so that the people can hear you. Uh, what song are you going to sing? Counting is easy as one, two, three. And that's a Brenton Woofy song, right? Yeah. Yeah. Do you believe that counting is as easy as one, two, three? One, two, three is counting. It is counting. You're right. And it is easy, isn't it? I think so. How high can you count to? 120. 120. Wow. That's pretty cool. Um, Marion, just come on over here and say good morning, okay? You, you, can, you want to talk into that mic there? I'll turn that one on. Uh, one of these is that mic. Wait, this one, this one. I think that one. Say hello, hello. Hi, Brent. Nope, it's not that one. You'll have to use the green one there. Hi, Brent. There, that's Marion. Good morning, Marion. How Good are morning. you? How long have you been with the Nanaimo Youth Choir? This is the 26th year of yeah. Nanaimo Youth Choir's existence. Wow, and you've been involved with it? Yeah, every, uh, I founded it. You founded it? In 1992. Nice. Um, you were just telling me that you had your 25th and you sent some kids to Carnegie Hall, right? We all went to the concert choir. Um, of Nanaimo Youth Choir went to uh, Carnegie Hall right. two years ago. Ooh. Yes, and took part in a children's uh, pr um, premiere performance with a children's choir made up of choirs from North America, and it was a very exciting I and guess. fabulous musically. The funny part about this, kids, is that I was talking to these young kids singing, and I said, okay, now you're going to sing in the choir, now you're going to do radio. Next stop is Carnegie Hall. And Marion says, we've already done it. <laughs> That's a fact. We did it with a lot of help from Nanaimo, too, who helped us to raise enough money to yeah. to get there. It, it How was, many kids are in the choir now? Oh, not as many as we'd like. Yeah. Uh, probably total this year is about 20. Yeah. Um, huh. yeah, which is not very many. We've been up as high as 50 and 60. Really? Previous years with the two cars or three cars even, we had a small ensemble group at uh, a few years ago, mm. too, of older kids. So... Uh, not as many kids uh, seem to take, you, you know. want to lift that mic up? Think, <laughs> She's think, bent over for the kids' size, but you can lift it up if you want. Yeah, go ahead. Seems like not as many kids realize um, what fun comes with mm. the friendship and camaraderie of um, sharing music together in something like a choir. How old are these and, kids? Uh, these, well, we our program goes from ages, is supposed to be six, but we keep going down. So we have some four-year-olds now. And uh, it goes right up to high school and beyond mm. for a year or two beyond if, if the kids stay that long. Um, and we've done many things. We've traveled a lot of places. So it's, it's really a lot of fun. And friendships yeah. are lifelong that are yep. formed in choir when you work together like that. You know? <laughs> I was talking to you the other day about bumping into some of the kids that sang on my CDs back in 1995. Yes, imagine yeah. that. Eh? Yeah, it yeah. is very, because you know, they're, they're old enough to have kids themselves now. Absolutely. Yeah. We, uh, I have seen some of them. Some of them have come to see me with their children. Uh, makes me feel very old, but, <laughs> but very excited too for them. And I can't wait for them to have their children in in the Nanaimo Youth Choir, if yeah. I'm still around that long. But some of them are getting pretty much old enough now. <laughs> you have, yeah, you have a website they could go to? Oh, yes, Nanaimo Youth Choir. Well, there you go. Yeah. There you go, Nanaimo Youth Choir. Well, yeah, it's a I mouthful. Just, I just washed my mouth. You know what? Um, I come in here and do this for three hours. It's the most talking I do in like a whole month. So <laughs> by the time I get here, I've got my mouth troubles. <laughs> so, 
<laughs> yeah, it's NanaimoYouthCorps.ca, but I should also say that we are affiliated with the Nanaimo Conservatory of Music. Okay. So people can always get in touch with us through the conservatory. So how long has this little monkey been in with you? Ah, I think this is probably Mara's fourth year. Fourth year? And so she's she started eight. when she's four. Yes, she's one oh, of them. Kids are she so has much... an older sister yeah. that went all the way through oh. Nanaimo Youth Choir and came to Carnegie Hall with us. Mm. She sang with us for years. Hilaria. She started when she's four. Kids are so much smarter today at four than they were, uh, you know, when when I was four. Well, I don't know. 150 years ago. You think so? I don't know if they're smarter, but they sure get lots of opportunity. Yeah, maybe maybe you're right. Yeah, they, they're not any smarter. They just have a, more ways to show it with the computers and yeah. four-year-olds. Like, I, I see six-year-olds with cell phones now. It's like, eh, yeah. You know? yeah, no kidding. That used to be for just us privileged older folks. Now, yeah. now the kids now the kids <laughs> have. Mara, 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 do you have a cell phone? Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> She, we can't hear you until you, you got to talk right into that microphone, sweetie. So no. why don't we get into the song? Just give that a little twist. That, yeah, give, yeah, just give it. Yeah, yeah, there you go. There. Maybe even a little bit more so she's facing right in there. Okay. Are you ready, Ma Mara? Why do I keep calling her Myra? I don't know. I don't know. You're not Myra. You're Mara. I know why. Because you're the only person that I know with that name. Yeah, she's the only person. Do you know anybody else named Mara, Mara? Uh, there's someone in fifth grade. Oh, there is. What school do you go to? Hammond Bay. Yeah, what grade are you in? Two. You're in grade two at Hammond Bay. And you know somebody in fifth grade? Yes. Oh, good for you. Are you ready? Did you do your Mia, Mia, Me's and your warm-ups out there? Did you I, get it all ready? I think so. You're all ready? What song are you going to sing? I already asked you that. It's counting as easy, and I do the intro, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. She's boun bouncing up and down, so she's ready to go. So I'll start with the intro, and we're going to see if I can get all the way through this one without forgetting it. Here we go. She hasn't blinked. Did you stare through the whole thing? Yeah. How'd you feel? Did you feel her talk right into that thing so we can hear you? How did you feel doing that? Good? Fun. Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? Yeah, did, did, did you think your boyfriend heard it? I don't have a boyfriend. You don't have a boyfriend? How come? Because I'm too young. Too young. I guess you're not married then either, are you? No, she's shaking her head, folks. 
Well, thank you so much for doing that. Thank you, Marion. Thank you. Brian. It was a lot of fun. Did you have fun? Yes. Okay. You want to do it again sometime? Yes. Okay. We'll find another place and you can sing. And then what's your next stop? Carnegie, Carnegie Hall. Carnegie Hall. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much, kiddo. Thanks, Brent. Thank you. Take good care of yourself. Bye. Bye-bye for now. Wasn't that fun? Thank you, Marion. See you later, guys. Don't run away. I'll put a song on and come out and talk to you, okay? Yeah, don't go away yet. All right, kids. Um, there was Marion Smith with Mara Northrup from the Nanaimo Youth Choir and Angelo McCauley from um, Natural Growth Music Lessons with Stories.